excited. We're here in downtown right off Fremont Street at the El Cortez. We've never stayed here before. We are looking forward to seeing what the room is like and our entire experience. And I'll tell you, it's so cool, 1941, and it just has a very cool old Vegas vibe even from the outside here in the ballet area. And oh, boy, this is very cool. So we're gonna check in and we'll keep you posted and show you what our room looks like when we get up there. So the casino is pretty empty today, which is kind of nice. We're here on a weekday in the summer and it's record high heat. So looks like a lot of good machines. And we're gonna head over to the elevators up. Our room is on the 14th floor, so pretty high up. I think there are only 15 floors, so we shall see when we get up there. Just getting off the elevator. Oh, this is so cool. This is on the wall right when you get off. I love that. 14 for the 14th floor. We're going to head down the hallway, you know, the carpet looks clean, the walls are clean, neat lights outside of each room too. We just checked into El Cortez in Vegas, room 1404. We've never stayed here. We were sent um, an offer for a comped room, so we thought we'd give it a shot. Um, first impressions, it's not modern or contemporary, but it's clean and feels new though, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So it's been nicely remodeled. Yeah, it's been remodeled. Laminate floors, um, little desk area here. Good size TV, actually. Very good. And there's a fridge here, I think. Mr. G3 can open it up. Awesome. Yeah, and it feels cold. We like that because it's about 100 and what, 15, 20 today, I think. Um, there is a Keurig, which so rare to have a Keurig in the room. We usually have to carry our own, so we like that. A couple waters. Yeah, a couple waters. A little funny little chair and reading nook, I guess. And you know, it's actually good size. It is. Like you the beds are kind of yeah. tight, but uh -huh. um, so this is the closet. No doors or anything, but actually, you know, a lot of um, storage. I would say, you know, to put things up on the shelves. There is a safe and. A little, I guess, vanity area to put on makeup. Here's our view. We, um, she asked at check-in if we were light sleepers, and as I most certainly am, um, put us opposite Fremont Street, so we don't have the noise from there. So, the restroom actually is very cool. It's a subway tile, looks new, decent-sized vanity, um, kind of cool floor. And then the, the potty is in here. Um, good size shower, actually. Um, very cool. So I would say first impressions, very clean, smells clean, definitely remodeled. And um, you know, we'll see how the beds are in the shower and everything, but Mr. G3, would you agree so far so good? I agree, I, it's, I'm kind of impressed. Yeah. Well, for such an old hotel, it's been tastefully redone. Yeah, it's very cool. So we will uh, check back in with you guys. Hey, you guys, we're wrapping up our latest Vegas trip. We had such a great week. This was such a fun time. Super hot, crazy hot, 120 degree hot. But um, we had a wonderful time. We stayed our first two nights at Sahara in North Las Vegas. And we've already reviewed um, the rooms there and the property. So um, I'll put the link down below if you're interested in seeing. We really do like Sahara. It was very crowded this time, but, but we did enjoy it. And you can take the monorail, so the heat doesn't get you quite as much. You can take it to the Strip and it's air conditioned. It's very easy from Sahara. And the last two nights, we stayed at El Cortez in downtown. We had never stayed there before. We were a little bit apprehensive. It's such an older property, but we had heard that the tower rooms had been remodeled and it absolutely exceeded my expectations. It was wonderful. I absolutely love El Cortez. 
Yeah, you know, the, the rooms are so nice. They're, they're retro, like 1940s, but redone with all the modern amenities. Really nice refrigerator, Keurig coffee maker, 60-inch flat screen TV, completely remodeled bathroom, that, uh, great hot water, everything worked great, including the air conditioning, which is the first thing we checked when we got in there. And that room got cold and was so nice after coming back from 118 degree weather into that cold room. It was awesome. We loved it. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, the beds were really comfy and the room was very good size. Yeah, know, it, it was. was. Large, yeah. You know, a lot of room to, to move around and um, really enjoyed it. And I'll tell you, our um, housekeeper, Emma, is a star. She was so accommodating and did such a great job. Kept our room just immaculate. Gave us extra waters. I mean, yeah. just so kind to yeah. the entire staff at El Cortez. I just yeah. found so helpful and like genuinely seemed happy to yeah, be they're, there. Yeah, they're, and they're all great. It's like a, it's almost like a boutique hotel. Yeah, it's just really cool. Yeah, it, you know, <laughs> from the restaurants to the front desk and the valet was so kind. Um, brought us cold waters and yeah. you know was happy to help us get something out of our car that we forgot and yeah. <laughs> just very accommodating yeah. Um, yeah I would definitely recommend staying at El Cortez I mean I yeah. I it was quiet our room was quiet the floor yeah. was quiet um, it's a short walk to Fremont which yeah. is good you kind of want to be off Fremont a little anyway yeah we didn't hear any of that noise at all and um, yeah very quiet and I mean I'd say the only thing and you know it's nothing to do with the room or anything was we found the casino machines really tight yeah and we both you know just got wrecked <laughs> yeah, in didn't the do casino. Very good. Well, uh, we always done well before so i hope this is just a fluke yeah yeah <laughs> so we we tried a couple different nights there and just were like okay that's it for here so but i love staying there i would totally recommend staying there if you're looking for somewhere to stay downtown and um if you have any ideas on you know places we should check out we're open to trying new places i think we'll probably try the d um one of these next trips we've stayed at plaza and nugget liked them both so yeah. you know we've had really good experiences yeah. downtown it's it's definitely changed uh -huh. it's, but it is much different than the strip i mean holy cow there are some characters out there but we had a great time great place to stay totally recommend el cortez um Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe and like if you haven't. Um, we're super excited we hit 500 subscribers and we're just having a great time. So as always, thanks you guys.